I was born in the DC area uh, in Northern Virginia and shortly thereafter um, moved around the world. My dad was a diplomat so we moved initially to uh, Germany for four years, then Australia for five years, and then Vietnam for four. Uh, growing up around the world uh, offered me the opportunity to experience a lot of different cultures, meet a lot of different type of people, and I think that broadened my horizons in terms of who I am and how I interact with other people. At one and a half years old, I was diagnosed with acute lymphocytic leukemia and was treated for the next five years. Uh, at the National Institutes of Health. Um, and so my earliest heroes were my pediatric oncologists and they still remain friends today. So I think that going forward, I wanted to help people in a similar way. I met my wife uh, during residency um, in Baltimore, um, actually taking care of my first um, heart attack patient. She was the nurse in the intensive care unit um, who took care of that patient with me. And then a year later, we were married. And just 11 months ago, we had our uh, first baby girl, Amelia. Then we feel that this area and the close-knit community feel of this area in which neighbors look out for each other um, and people are very open with each other would be a great place to raise a family. I think the Thailand's health system is a great and growing health system in which they truly care about their patients. and. I feel privileged to be a part of that. My unique experiences as a patient, um, both in early childhood and actually more recently going through uh, open heart surgery for the removal of a tumor from my heart, um, allows me the ability to see uh, things from both the patient perspective as well as from the provider perspective, which I think can be important um, knowing the vulnerability, the sense of dependence that you have on someone else, and how difficult that can be. Um, and so I think that specifically allows me to better empathize with my patients.